every single player in the league does not have a team behind them because they are a free agent. I wonder if it's going to be any super teams, man. In the first day already, Giannis went to the Celtics, LeBron's on the Trailblazers, Lucas on the Grizzlies, Katie's on the Pistons, Steph's on the Rockets, and JT is on the Hawks. The Trailblazers got LeBron and Jimmy Butler. The Celtics got a trio of SGA, Embiid, and Giannis. John Morant went to the Thunder. The Grizzlies now have Luka and Kawhi on the same team. All right, so here's a look at a few of the teams. Of course, we got the Celtics with Giannis, Embiid, and SGA. Hawks with JT and James Harden. The Heat with Jokic and PG. Dane finally got a team around him. He also got Wimby. AD is on the Knicks with Tyler Hero. The Lakers got Jalen Brown, Tyrese Halliburton, Chris Middleton, and Brooke Lopez. D-Book, Trey Young, and Bam made a trio in Denver. Zion, Kyrie, and Pascal in Indiana. KD, Sabonis, and CJ teaming up in Detroit. Steph Curry teaming up with Brandon Ingram, Michael Porter Jr. in Houston. John Morant and Zach Levine are on the Thunder. LeBron and Jimmy playing together in Portland. Warriors ended up with Darius Garland, Jaron Jackson Jr. Sixers got LaMelo Ball, Bradley Beal, and Scotty Barnes. Mmm, the Bulls got Cade, Maxi, Barrett, and Sharp. So look at the all-star teams. This feels a lot like really the 2019 free agency. People were moving everywhere. Just about every star you could think of right, was on the move. Luka wins MVP, of course. Victor gets a rookie of the year. Fultz wins sixth man. Chet wins defensive player of the year. And most improved, okay. When Snyder wins coach of the year. All NBA teams are here. Luka just made all defensive first team. This is all defensive first team worthy. So this is the standings out east, and this is what I'm looking like out west. Pretty balanced, I'm not gonna lie. The Celtics with the big trio of SGA and B and Giannis go out on the first round. The Jokic, Paul George. Conference finals out east, we got JT Harden versus LaMelo, Bradley Bill, and Scotty. And then out west, we got Ja and Zach Levine versus Simons and Mikael Bridges. Okay, see, advances to the finals. We got a game five over here. We got a game seven. Minute 40 left, game seven, two point game. Gives it back to Beal. Hunter is playing amazing defense. Oh my God. LaMelo, clock one down. Gets past Harden. Can't get it to go. JT for three. It won't go. See if Beal can get something to go on Harden. Is the screen fading? No, he's not like that. AI, the AI shot selection is terrible. JT comes off the screen. Pull up. Mm, oh my goodness. Oh man, that puts him up one. Beal trying to go to work and he gets a foul call. James Harden got one possession to get it done. If he misses right here, it's probably over. I don't know why they took JT out the game. Takes a fadeaway, one-legged. That is not the shot they want. You work on that shot. Game seven, 23 to go, down three. Oh yeah, go get a buck, JT. Fading away, that's not a good shot. That's an awful shot. Philly is gonna meet the Thunder in the finals, playing against John Zach Levine. This is the finals matchup, man. It should be a good one. Game one goes to the Thunder. Four goes to Philly. And the Thunder are going to force a game six. The Thunder are pulling away. Oh, man. Philly hasn't scored since the war. Game seven. NBA finals should be a good one. Philly's absolutely running away with it. Philly gets the first title of the free agent league. LeBron finna try to retire, but I'm uh, I'm going to make him stay for a little bit. And Chris Paul. So the Thunder, who were just runners up in the championship, now have the second pick. Oh yeah, they they trying to they trying to get they trying to get wicked over there, bro. And there's not too too many free agents, but there's still some out there. And LeBron resigns with the Trailblazers. Going into year two, not much has changed as far as the rosters. I wonder what the NBA would do in this hypothetical situation. Like if this happened in real life and everybody was a free agent, like the NBA step in or would they just let it happen? These are the All Star teams again. Victor making an All Star appearance. Luke wins another MVP. Ben Thompson, Sixth Man of the Year. Victor with DPOY. Victor won DPOY and Most Improved. It's not everyone's bad to bad coach of the years. All NBA teams, man. Somehow Luka keeps making these all defensive teams. All right, so the conference finals out east is JT and James Harden going up against Chris Paul, Kyrie, and Zion, and Pascal, and Grady Dick. Out west, John Morant and Zach Levine are back. Going up against DG, Franz Wagner, Darren Jackson Jr., Robert Williams. Oh my goodness. Hawks go ahead and advance to the finals. Game six out in the west. Game one goes to the Hawks. Two goes to the Hawks. Time to get one finally. And the Hawks win the finals. JT wins finals. Yeah, once again, the teams are looking pretty much the same. Although you got some guys like Harden decreasing. Paul George is a 79. Golly. So this is where the younger guys are really starting to shine through. That's crazy. Jabari and Paolo ended up playing in, in Orlando after literally <laughs> Orlando took Paolo over Jabari. Man, Steph Curry and B.I. made no noise. And the Thunder are so deep, bro. They got Bronny James backing up Ja. I forgot to tell you, LeBron did retire in the offseason. 
I think it's safe to say this Celtics team has easily been the most disappointing. You got Embiid, Giannis, and SJA all on the same team and still can't make nothing shake. These are the all-star teams once again. Luka goes back to back to back on the MVPs, man. Trey Young won a sixth man of the year. Victor Dipuyawa. Amari Bailey's most improved. Whoever this is won coach of the year. Bro, Luka keeps making these all defensive teams, bro. I'm about to get mad. Off-ball pass. When does he ever stand on somebody off-ball like that, bro? Celtics went out round one, bro. That is so sad. Out East, the conference finals is Lonzo Ball, Donovan Mitchell, Cat, and Nick Claxton versus CP3, Kyrie, Grady Dick, and Zion. Out West, we got Ja, Zach Levine, Brandon Miller, and Julius Randle. That's pretty much it. Rudy ended up back on the Jazz. Wow. The Thunder are back in the finals. We got a game seven in the conference finals on the East. Lock in your predictions right now. What y'all got? What's the money line on this one? What's the money line? Oh my God. Yeah, the Pacers are smacking them. So the NBA finals is Kyrie and Zion versus Ja and the boys. Ja versus Kyrie, 2019 draft. That was That's a good storyline right there, bro. I'm not going to lie. Ja takes game one, game two, and game three. Is he about to sweep them? And the Thunder win a championship. Is it the first one they've won? I don't know. These are the standings for this year on the east and west side, if anybody was wondering. Okay, so this is the free agent pool. It's, it's a lot of guys in here. JT's returning to the Celtics. Luka's returning to the Mavericks. Jar goes to the Rockets. All these guys going back to their old teams. Zion's going to the Bucks. SGA went to the Heat. And somehow, the Nuggets fumbled Jokic, and now the Heat have him. The league is really shaking up once again, bro. JT and Giannis teaming up on the Celtics. They're actually the two best players in the league, according to 2K right now. All right, so let's look at some of the different teams. Lamelo and Jimmy teamed up. Zion and Bam are in Milwaukee. Evan Mobley and D-Mitch, okay. SGA and Jokic on Miami. Steph Curry went to play with Jabari Smith Jr. in Orlando. Luka is now back on the Mavericks playing with Chet. And the Pacers replaced Zion with Joel Embiid. The Rockets also replaced Steph Curry with John Moran. I mean, this is a new look Thunder, but they're they're really deep, man. I, they can still make a run. All-star teams. Bro, Luka will not stop winning MVPs, bro. It's literally the same awards as last year. Thank God Luka didn't make the defensive team this year. All right, out east in the conference finals, we got the Magic versus the Rappers. Out west is... See, I told y'all the Thunder was going to be back, bruh. Playing the Warriors again. And they still got a one seed. I told you that was nice, bruh. We got a game seven out east. Raptors versus the Thunder in the finals, man. I told y'all the Thunder was nice, bruh. I told you that it was nice, bruh. Game one goes to the Raptors. Two goes to the Raptors. Three goes to the Raptors. Four goes to the Thunder. And the Raptors. <laughs> Four one. I'm after I just said the Thunder were nice. That's it for this one, but, you know, we got plenty more coming. So if you want to... Going along, you can hit right here. Uh, if you want to watch another video, you can hit right here.